And when your son looks at you and says, Mama, look, you won, bullies don't win. And I no. said, baby, they don't. Because we're going to go in there and we're going to impeach the mother Out of these troubled times, our fifth objective, a new world order can emerge, a new era, freer from the threat of terror, stronger in the pursuit of justice, and more secure in the quest for peace. An era in which the nations of the world, East and West, North and South, can prosper and live in harmony. A hundred generations have searched for this elusive path to peace, while a thousand wars raged across the span of human endeavor. And today that new world is struggling to be born. And now we can see a new world coming into view. A world in which there is the very real prospect of a new world order. In the words of Winston Churchill, a world order in which the principles of justice and fair play protect the weak against the strong. A world where the United Nations, freed from Cold War stalemate, is poised to fulfill the historic vision of its founders. I'm warning you, I'm giving you fair warning, you belong to a militia, you had better get yourselves ready. You better get yourselves ready, and if you don't, you better seek out and join one. If you can't find one, start one of your own. All my life, ladies and gentlemen, I have watched this happen in other countries. I've watched it. It happened in other countries all around the world. As the Soviet change agents moved in, the socialist Marxists in those countries worked their wiles and used psychopolitics against the population.